How dare you hit your sister? What were you thinking? Why did you do that? Automatic response to when we see a child hitting another child. And that's fair enough. I mean, it is really overwhelming in that moment, but we have to really learn how to support a child through those moments. So a child that is displaying hitting, kicking, biting a sibling is just trying to communicate their frustration, their anger, their disappointment, or some feeling that's happening inside them. And they don't have the brain development to actually process that emotion. So they can only kind of think about one thing at a time in their brain. So when they have that big feeling or emotion, they're literally going to have a reflexive action means that they're going to act on impulse. So that thing that you just saw happening right there, try not to take it personally. Don't threaten or, you know, or try and punish the child for what they've done. Really try and help them build their skill set. It's those moments that are teachable moments. Those are the moments that we can teach children what to do instead. I can see you're really angry and then put the boundary in. It's really important. Your sister's not for hitting hands on our own body. If you feel angry, you can stomp your feet or clench your fists and, you know, give them some other coping mechanisms for that emotion or feeling. That's the way we build emotional intelligence. That's the way we build emotional regulation. Help your child co-regulate in that moment.